Hi everybody, my name is Horia Perutsu and I'm a developer advocate at Miro. In this video, we're gonna take a look at the top five most popular and used Miro apps and integrations. We're gonna start with a couple easier ones, more UI based ones, so Google Images and Google Drive. And then we're gonna move to some more complex two-way sync integrations with Jira, Azure, and Salesforce. So without further ado, let's get right into it. The first one is gonna be Google Images. So I'm sure you've used Google Images before. And as you can see, I've pinned all my favorite apps and integrations in uh, my toolbar here. So we're gonna go um, use Google Images. And I've already created a little template here. I have a quick retrospective. I'm gonna start the timer now for five minutes and let's do our retro. So we've got the team here. And what are we gonna keep doing? So basically what I've been working on is actually this video of the top mirror apps and integrations. And I'm gonna keep using some of the logos that are working for us. So one of the logos that I need to use is OpenAI. And here I can just drag and drop that picture. I can resize, of course, add a nice little um, uh, border around it. And there you go. This is the Google Images integration, nice and simple. All right, so we saw a nice and simple one. We're gonna keep going with the simple topic. Google Drive is next. So you wanna import a PDF or some sort of a document from your drive onto your board and let's do that now. So here is Drive. I'm going to go ahead and grab one of the thumbnails that I worked on and I'm going to add it into my stop. So we like the thumbnail overall but our uh, style guide has changed. So we're gonna stop using kind of this specific, uh, this specific type of thumbnail. So I'm gonna add that in there. Nice, so we've gone through a couple UI focused uh, apps and integrations. Now let's dive into the nitty gritty. Let's get into the integration side of things, the two way six. So first let's start with Jira. Uh, this is a great one, one of the most popular uh, mirror apps and one of the most uh, used as well. So let's go ahead. What we're gonna do is I've already logged into my Jira account. Of course, you're gonna need, you're gonna need to authenticate and I'm not gonna show that here, but I'm gonna show you how to import this, um, this specific Jira task. And I'm just going to do something like update the title and maybe I'll add in a priority here, uh, moving it from Trivial. So here is our link, which is dr959. And basically here's my Jira cards. I'm gonna go ahead and search for this specific ticket, or this specific issue. And I can just go ahead and grab it. And let's say now I wanna put this in the act because I wanna do this, I wanna finish this video. I wanna get this out and post this on YouTube. Um, and let's go ahead and, and actually edit this issue. So we're gonna make this critical and, and we're gonna say post to YouTube. And then I can just click on update. And then you can see the priority has changed. And if I go ahead and um, check that here, also if I refresh this, you can see even without refreshing it's changed and the priority has changed. And that's really nice. So now that we've seen Jira, let's go ahead and show uh, uh, Azure. So same thing with Azure, I have a couple projects that I wanna show you. Um, and I can go into the board and you can see I have, you know, film the video and send for feedback and uh, create thumbnail and description. So let's go ahead and import some of these. So same thing as Jira, you're going to have to authenticate. So uh, I'll let that, I'll let you handle the authentication part. And if I want to search and actually, um, let's go and bring in a couple of these. We'll add two. So again, I'm going to say uh, create this create, I'm going to put this in the, uh, I'm going to put this in the, how could we do, do things differently? I want to create the script in a different fashion next time. And maybe let's just say, instead of done, I'm going to go ahead and, oh, now we're getting close. So let's say I want to edit this and instead of done, I'm going to say doing, I'm going to update this and let's see that you can see it has been updated uh, there. Cool. And, oh yeah, sorry, here's the that one doing, and then exactly, let's just say now we want to say, 
change this uh, for YouTube. I'm gonna save it. And then now, same thing. If I click this, I should be able to see the updated version of that. There you go. So kind of same thing as, as before, you're gonna need to open the side panel to see the updated view, uh, but it's another great way to bring in and work within uh, Miro for all of your sprint planning. Last but not least, let it, let's show Salesforce. So Salesforce for Miro, similar app. Uh, this one has a free trial, so you may have to pay for a subscription depending on, on uh, how, many, um, how many boards you wanna use. So again, you're gonna authenticate here. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and import a couple opportunities here, and it's gonna let me go ahead and choose some opportunities from Salesforce. And let's just go say I go ahead and import this opportunity, and you're gonna to need to, e this is a free trial, so if you use it enough, you will have to pay for a subscription. Um, but here I have my, um, my opportunity that I want to actually do things differently with, and I'm gonna put that here, and let's go ahead and say that it's an AI LLC, uh, but let's just, I'll just say based in uh, Netherlands. So I'm gonna change that. Uh, I'm just gonna put in Netherlands. I'll click on update, and then if we want to go ahead and find that, um, we can do flex fund. Flex fund, and you can find it here. And again, uh, you see that has been updated. Uh, to that uh, Netherlands. Um, you, we see we have Netherlands there, and let's just say um, I want to update the title one more time, and I'll say the amount is just one euro, and let's just say uh, instead of an AI LLC, we'll just say a, uh, an AI BV, um, and now this should also be updated if I just quickly refresh the page again the updates uh, are coming through okay so that's pretty much it I've done my nice uh, retrospective here with my team I saw that I'm going to continue using some of the logos we've worked with I'm going to stop uh, doing some of the uh, thumbnails that we've been working on and then I've nicely imported things from both Jira Azure and Salesforce updated them all within Miro and uh, quickly was able to do that and had everybody on our team stay in sync. If you found this helpful, do not forget to like and subscribe. This helps the channel grow a lot and make sure we can keep investing in building great content for you. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.